guys today I have got to do some work on my own lawn we're gonna aerate right now I've got my son push mowing the front yard and when he's done with that then I'm gonna mow the side yard and the backyard we push mow the front because there's some it there's a little hill there and the, the bigger mowers don't do so good there so we are going to do that, then I'm going to mow the side yard and the backyard, and then I'm going to plug aerate with the Agrifab plug aerator, and then after that I'm going to overseed. So that is what we've got going on on this Friday afternoon. Guys, this channel is all about helping you as a lawn care business owner become more efficient so that you have more time for family, free time, and fun. And so that is what we are going to do today. Now, if you haven't yet, smash that like button. That helps these videos go farther, helps the algorithm see it. Let's get this video to at least 100 likes. I'm not sure if I've ever gotten a video to 100 likes before, Let's do it on this video right here. Now, number two, I just started a podcast. The podcast is called Mowing in the Dark. I know, listen to the podcast, you'll find out what the name is all about, and we will go from there. All right, so let's jump into this video. Let's get some work done. Let's get at it. All right, guys, as you can see behind me here, I've got the big one, that's what I call this kid over here. Uh, got him doing some strikes with that Time Master. He really likes push mowing. Uh, once he learns, I'm sure he'll love riding the big mowers better, but he does pretty good with the stripes. So big one, what was your motivation for wanting to mow the front yard today? So I could drive my remote control car and the grass. I see. The grass was a little long and he just got, he just worked for all winter and most of the summer to earn money to buy his first really nice, what was it, $250? $211. $211. He's pretty precise. Uh, for a new RC car. Tell us what your RC car is. I forgot the model. No, but what 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 brand is it? Traxxas. So it's the Traxxas model. The thing is wicked fast. <laughs> so he's in love with that thing. So he had some serious motivation to mow the lawn this afternoon. All right, guys, really quick before I get to work, the boys wanted to show you this new RC car. So let's see how big this thing actually is. It's the size of a little child. All right, guys, we've got the lawn all mowed. It's all looking good, looking ready to go. And I've got the aerator hooked up to the Gravely ZTX. Now, I've never hooked up the aerator to the Gravely before. In fact, I just got in this hitch that can go on the back of the Gravely. If you guys go down in the in the description of this video I'm gonna have a link to this hitch I bought it on Amazon uh, so if you guys have a ZTX uh, whatever size it is and you need a hitch click that link down there and grab your hitch from Amazon and when you guys do that uh, that link just gives me a little kickback from the purchase of that hitch uh, just to help out with the cost of making these videos they take a lot of time guys so it, it really takes a lot of brain power that's why I don't put out a whole ton of them in the summertime because it just takes so much time so if you guys could click that link buy your hitch if you need one support the channel smash that like button let's get aerating
right guys, so we're done with the front part of the yard here. Something that I noticed that I didn't see because my son has been mowing the front yard. Uh, we buried our sump pump line and uh, look at what's happening here. So if you can see that, that's like a divot right there. I got to put some dirt in there. It's kind of collapsing down a little bit from where we dug and put that in. Just right, just right here. We're pulling okay plugs today. Um, it, it is, it is kind of dry. Um, didn't rain at all last week and didn't rain at all this week. So let me show you the plug size here. So we're pulling, you know, inch, inch and a half plugs. Not super good, but uh, I mean, it's, it's not terrible, but it, it certainly could be better. Um, the ground is just a little harder than what I like it to be. guys I'm gonna stop there uh, it's a long process so thanks for watching guys um, the agrifab plug aerator has been doing great I'm still pulling okay plugs uh, they're a little bit bigger back here it's a little bit wetter back here so um, not too bad uh, it is a little dry though so it is what it is uh, guys thanks so much for watching be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and check out the Mowing in the Dark podcast. And I will see you guys in the next video.